Hey everyone, this is Josh Martin. I'm one of the board members at BOSS, and I was asked to read you a book today as part of Read Across America Week, coming up here in March. Helping me out today is my daughter Mila. She's in the first grade, and um, she'll be a big help today, so let's get started. Today we're going to read the book Dragons Love Tacos. Ready? Okay. Hey, kid. Did you know that dragons love tacos? They love beef tacos and chicken tacos. They love really, really big gigantic tacos and tiny, tiny little baby tacos. As well. Okay, now I'll read the next one. Why do dragons love tacos? Maybe it's the smell from the sizzling pan. Maybe it's the crunch of the crispy tortillas. Maybe it's a secret. Either way, if you want to make friends, with dragons, tacos are key. Hey, dragon, why do you guys love tacos so much? Let's show them the pictures. So there's the dragons making the tacos. The taco cave. All right. But wait, as much as dragons love tacos, they hate spicy salsa even more. They hate spicy salsa that's green and spicy salsa that's red. They hate, they hate spicy chunky salsa and spicy smooth salsa. If the salsa is spicy at all, dragons can't stand it. You see them figuring out what kind of salsa to use for the tacos. Okay. All right. Dragons hate spicy salsa. We will just one drop of hot salsa make a dragon ears smoke. Just one single single speck, speck of hot pepper make a dragon snort snort spark. spark. Spicy salsa gives dragons a tummy trouble. trouble. And when dragons get a tummy trouble, trouble. oh boy. Now I'll read this. If you want to make tacos for your dragons, keep the toppings mild. Tomatoes, lettuce, cheese, these are all good toppings for dragon tacos. You see here. Dragon's ears are smoking because of the salsa, but they said if you use these three things, the dragons will like them better. All right? Okay. All right, next page. Hey, dragon, how do you feel about spicy ta taco toppings? There's the dragon. And they're asking the question, how they feel about the toppings. And the dragon says, dragons love parties. They like costume parties and pool parties. And big gigantic parties with accordions. They like little parties with charades. Why do dragons love parties? Maybe it's the conversation. Maybe it's the dancing. Maybe it's the comforting sound of a good friend's laughter. But these are all the different types of parties. Dragons like to go to. There's this one, there's dress up, there's a pool party, there's like a dancing party, and there's the small party, which are small party. Mm -hmm. The only thing dragons love more than parties, parties is tacos. And taco it, parties. And taco parties. Taco parties are per Parties with lots of tacos. If you want to have some dragons over for a taco party, you'll need buckets, buckets of tomatoes, tacos, tacos, 
Hand loads. Hand loads of tacos. Tacos. The best way to judge, judge is to get a boat mm -hmm. and fill the boat with tacos. That's about how many taco dragons need for a taco party. After all dragons love tacos. So, go ahead and get part. Go ahead. Hey dragons, are you excited for the big taco party? The dragons love tacos so much here that you fill the whole boat with tacos. Over there. That's how many you'll need. And there, and there. And mm -hmm. also here, here's the tomatoes. Mm -hmm. All the tomatoes and there's some tacos. Okay. Just remember, dragons hate spicy salsa. Before you host your taco party with dragons, get rid of all the spicy salsa. In fact, bury the spicy salsa in the backyard so the dragons can't find it. So here's the little boy's house. Here's the little boy's house, and he's all the way back there. Dig a hole up, put some salsa in it, and the dragons are right up here looking for it. Yep. Okay. These dragons love your taco party. They love the music. They love the decorations. They especially love the tacos. Congratulations! So, they're saying congratulations here because you had a successful taco party. The dragons are there and they love the tacos you made. It's a good thing you got rid of all that spicy. Wait, a wait a second. What are those little green things and the salsa? You didn't read the sign. 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 Print. Print. So the boy accidentally used totally mild salsa, and it had little green things in it. What do you think those little green things might have been? Feet. Mm. We'll find out here. Dragons, listen to me. Do not eat these tacos. Those little green specks in the salsa, those are jalapeno peppers. They are super spicy. I know you love tacos, dragons, but you are not going to love these tacos. Do not let those dragons eat those tacos. Crunch, crunch, crunch. So these little tacos had jalapeno peppers in them. Very spicy peppers. Not good for the dragons. No. Too late! Uh oh, the dragons ate the spicy peppers. Now they're breathing fire everywhere. And they might get, and it's flying all over the place. It's flying all over the place. Oh, and here's just some pictures here. The dragons, their noses were smoking because of because, how hot the peppers were. Yeah. And there is hot pepper, so that's probably why. Why would the dragons help your you, help you rebuild. rebuild your house? Maybe they're good, good Samaritans. Maybe they're Pay. they feel bad for Wrecking. Wrecking the egg. Maybe they're just yeah. in for it for a taco break. break. So the, talk, the dragons felt bad because their fire breathing the burnt house. down the house, so now they're going to help build a new house. And there's tacos over here they're waiting for. Mm hmm. Almost there. After all, dragons love tacos. And that is the end. The dragons love tacos. Okay. Well, thank you very much for tuning in today to listen to uh, myself and my daughter Mila read this story to you. We want to encourage you to all to keep reading past this. Even though it's Reading Across America Week, you don't got to do it just this week. Do it all year round. Improve your reading. 
just like Mila's doing in her school. God bless you all. See you soon. Bye-bye.